morning children welcome back to standard 2 mental math class today we are going to do two topics time and calendar now children how do you measure time we measure time by using clocks have you seen a clock children yes you all have seen a clock now the face of a clock is called the dial and the dial is divided into 12 equal parts and a clock has two hands long hand and short hand the long hand is called the minute hand and the short hand is called the hour hand now 60 seconds make 1 minute 60 minutes make an hour and 24 hours make a day now let's do the next topic calendar what does the calendar shows children it shows the months weeks dates and days one year has 12 months dash months have 31 days how many months have 31 days let's see january march may july august october and december that is 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 7 months have 31 days dash months have 30 days april june september and november that is 1 2 3 and 4 4 months have 30 days now do you know children february is a special month it has 28 or 29 days every 4 years it has 29 days that year is called a leap year so there are 365 days in a year and 366 days in a leap year 7 days make a week and 52 weeks make a year now february has 28 or 29 days one year is equal to 365 days a leap year is equal to 366 days 7 days make 1 week and 1 year is equal to 52 weeks now let's do the questions a clock has dash hands how many hands two hands the long hand of a clock is called the dash hand it is called the minute hand the short hand of the clock is called the dash hand it is called the hour hand the face of a clock is called the yes dial the dial is divided into dash equal parts 12 equal parts dash hours make a day how many hours 24 hours make a day next 2 hours is equal to dash minutes now how you will do children 
1 r is equal to 60 minutes. So, 2 hours is equal to 60 multiplied by 2, you get 120. So, your answer is 2 hours is equal to 120 minutes. Question number 8, 2 days is equal to dash hours. So, one day how many hours? One day is equal to 24 hours. So, two days is equal to 24 Multiply by 2, you get 2 fours are 8, 2 twos are 4. So 48 hours. Question number 9. How many hours are there from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m.? So you'll count from the next number 10, 11, 12, 1, 2. So how many hours? 5 hours. It takes the shorthand dash hours to go round the clock. So how many hours? 12 hours. What time will it be? 2 hours after 4 o'clock. 2 hours after 4 o'clock. That means you'll count after 4 is 5, 6. 6 o'clock. Question number 12. Dash seconds make a minute. How many seconds? 60 seconds. If the long hand is on 12 and the short hand is on 5, what time is it? It is 5 o'clock. Dash months make a year. How many months make a year, children? 12 months. A leap year has dash days. A leap year has 366 days. A leap year comes after every dash years. After every? Yes. Four years. February has dash days. February has 28 or 29 days. 18 dash days make a week. How many days make a week, children? Yes, seven days make a week. Dash is the second day of the week. Which is the second day of the week? Very good. Tuesday is the second day of the week. The five weeks is equal to dash days. So one week is equal to seven days. So five weeks is equal to five Multiply by 7 is equal to 35. So 5 weeks is equal to 35 days. A year has dash weeks. A year has, very good, 52 weeks. Name the months 
that begins with M. March and May, which is the sixth month of the year. Which is the sixth month of the year, children? January, February, March, April, May, June. So, June is the sixth month of the year. Dash months have 30 days. How many months have 30 days? Four months have 30 days. April and July have dash days. So, April is 30 days and July is 31 days. Together, it is 61 days. Okay, children? Now, children, revise these topics and learn the spellings of the months properly. Thank you.